Welcome back, this is Yamachak Tries Cook Serve Delicious. This is available for $10.99 on Steam Canadian, uh, so probably like $10 American. Uh, it is currently 75% off for Cook Serve Delicious 1, which means it's $2.74 on Steam right now as of the time of recording this. Uh, and the trilogy is actually 64% off in total, so you can get the entire trilogy for $15.47 uh, $15 Canadian, which is a pretty banging deal in my opinion. I've never played Cook Serve Delicious before. It's a uh, it's a very popular game. I understand what it is. You gotta go with like this and then dump some mustard on it for them and then go ahead and serve that. Uh, I, don't, I don't want to use the mouse to serve it though. That doesn't, that doesn't sound like a good idea. Okay, so we're going to have to put on some meat. Need to wait a few seconds for the meat to grill at the right temperature. Once the order turns blue, it's ready to be prepped. Select the order too soon or too late, and your customer will have a raw slash burned meat and will likely have a bad rating. It's never going to finish until I click on this, right? Cool. Uh, meat, lettuce, bacon, cheese, and tomatoes. And then enter for the bun. Nice. Cannot, you have to click. I don't want to use the mouse though. Raw, cooked, prep, cooked, serve, cooked. Well, burned. <laughs> Uh, you can only prepare one order at a time, however you can serve yellow cooked serve orders to customers immediately even when preparing a different order. Simply press the number or click on the order to serve at any time. Customers won't wait around forever to have their food order taken notice that this food is slowly disappearing from the screen if it goes away. Yeah, I want I want to click on it though. Why are you making me fail? Why are you making me fail? That just makes me feel bad. It's my main managing menu men menu. Next page. First, we need to buy some food to put on the menu. You have a starting budget that should allow you to purchase three to five foods out of the initial 20 that's offered. You can do that via the view or buy foods menu. It's all good. Like, look, it's it's a go main. A view or buy foods. We're gonna need some some fancy stuff. So we'll uh, we'll go ahead and get uh, how much money do we have? We have seventy four hundred dollars. Yeah, we'll get some some corn dogs in there. Back to foods. Uh, we'll go for. Gotta have a drink. Thousand dollars for soda fountain. That sounds about right. And uh, you know you gotta get some some chicken breast. Yeah. And I guess we can throw in like a pretzel as well. Cause why not? Is this a good idea? I don't know. Let's start a new day. Your active menu. Yeah, I want to enable like all of these, okay? So we're gonna have corn dogs, we're gonna have pretzels, we're gonna have fountain drinks, and then chicken breast. I think that that's a good mix of foods. If you go to like a McDonald's or something like that, you know? That's about what you would expect. We're gonna start off with the chicken breast. Tenderize with mallet exactly six times, then season and cook. So one, two, three, four, five, six, season, cook. So how's your day going, sir? Never mind, we got somebody else. Medium diet, please. Uh, so we're gonna want a diet. We're gonna wanna pour the drink. Uh, ice cubes. Serve, I guess. Uh, yeah, so we'll go ahead and tenderize with one, two, three, four, five, six, and then season and cook. Nice and easy. Just like that, I have mastered this game already. Uh, you need to flush it. Yeah, go ahead and flush it, sanitize my hands. What you gonna do? Just mustard, please? There you go. Off you go. Have a nice day, sir. Look at that. Three perfect combos. I'm getting. I'm mastering this game. I am mastering this game. Didn't even stop. He just walked right through. That's what I'm talking about. That's what that's what your boss wants to see, you know? Drive through times of, like, zero. You know? Just catch up and mustard, please. There you go. Have a nice day, sir. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oops. Season it again. Sure. Whatever. Uh, flush and sanitize. Then we're going to have a um, one, two, three, four, five, six. Season and cook. One, two, three, four, five, six. Season and cook. And then you want a uh, medium cola with ice. Medium cola with. Uh, so we're going to change that up. 
this, 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 and then you're going to get served. All right. Very simple. It's a very simple process. Very, very simple. You don't have to, you don't have to worry about it too much, okay? So we're going to go for a large water with ice. And you want a large water with ice as well. And you want a uh, medium grape with ice as well. Okay, we'll go ahead and do that. We'll take you. And uh, you want a, uh, a large diet with ice. So you can go ahead and have that. One, two, three, four, five, six. Season and cook it. Hey. One, two, three, four, five, six. Season and cook it. You got a, a medium cola with ice. And somebody's gone ahead and messed up the bathroom again. Oh, we gotta take out the trash, lift the trash, throw the trash, sanitize, lift the trash, throw the trash, lift the trash, throw the trash, lift the trash, lift. God, how much trash do we have? That's probably about normal for a, um, with ice. What is this? The dishes need cleaning. You want me to clean dishes? I can't clean dishes. Butter and cinnamon, please. There you go, sir. Have a nice day. Large cola with ice. Off you go. I don't know why you'd come through for just a large cola. That seems like a uh, pretty poor decision for your physical and financial health. But, you know, ultimately, I mean, I wanted to change the cup size down. Okay, well, you're getting a large. Just toss some of it out. It's okay, bud. Look, it's our mistake. You can just take it. You don't got to pay for it. It's okay. Here's a free coupon for next time you come back. You can get a, another free drink. They're free refills, don't tell them. Here's your corn dog. I did sanitize my hand after cleaning the toilet. Don't worry, ma'am. Chicken breath. One, two, three, four, five, six. Season and cook. Look at that. I don't know why we're tenderizing it on demand, but. I mean, that seems pretty weird. You know, small water with ice. I got you covered, fam. There you go, bud. So you're going in for a water, I get. You know, you're out, you're out running around, you're doing your thing, and you're just, you're thirsty, you know? I mean, you need some, some water. You're walking past the McDonald's, you're walking past the Tim Hortons, you're walking past the Starbucks or something. You go in there, and you're like, yeah, I'll take just the water, please, if you can do that for me. Oops, one, two, three, four, five, six. I did it kind of backwards for you, but you know what? I tell you what, we can give you a, a free coupon. Okay, how does that make you feel? Yeah, I know, I haven't sanitized my hand in between, you know, doing that, but uh, I just, it's really important for me to uh, make sure that it gets out anyway, so it doesn't, you know, It's not really about your uh, silly little one, two, three, four, five, six. Boom! Look at that. Beautiful. Look at this diverse group of individuals waiting on their chicken breasts. They got nothing else, just chicken breast. Oops! I'm sorry. I, have to, I sent you a raw chicken breast. Don't eat that. I officially recommend against the eating of that. Okay? Just uh, doesn't seem like a particularly great idea for you to do that. Look, we gotta. We got a little bit of a mouse problem in here. Don't worry, it's not on your food. It's just in my shoes. It's kind of annoying, honestly. A medium diet with ice. You know, I'm gonna be honest with you, there's no point to the diet. You're still getting a lot of badness in there. Your best option is to go for water. I can respect the water. Yes, yes, I want you to do ketchup and mustard. There you go, sir. Have a nice day. What do you want? Ketchup and mustard? You're back again? Have a nice night. Look, sometimes you say day when it's night. Sometimes you say night when it's day. It's just... You get into a habit, and you, you mess it up, you know? It's just... It's just what happens, I'm afraid. No, you can you can have your chicken breast, bud. Don't worry. I'll get you your chicken breast. 
There you go, sir. Have a nice night. Now, how do I lock these doors again? Serve four foods in one day. Did it. Complete 20 days of service. Did not do that because I've only completed two days of service. Get a 12 times perfect combo on three separate days. Easy. Buy six standard food or drinks for your menu. Make over $100 in tips. Tip jar required. We got to get a tip jar, yo. We got to get a tip jar. Uh, let's go for equipment. What do we got in here? We got a grill station. We got a deep fryer station. We got a tip trays or jar. Give me that. I want that. I need that in my life. Upgrade foods. All right, let's go to let's go to view buy foods. We're gonna change up the menu here a little day a little bit. You know the chicken breast was working great, but I'm not sure how I feel about the uh, this this the cinnamon pretzel thing. You know it's uh it's just it wasn't working out so great for us. So I think we're gonna have to replace it with a uh, baked potato. We have to move up into the into the more fancy stuff because I think that's what was doing what, what was doing our best there. So we're going to go ahead and in here, we're going to set us up with uh, with none of these pretzels. We don't need pretzels. People don't want pretzels. People want the potatoes. We've got a tip jar somewhere. Why, did I not even put it out? Do you have to like put it out? Large tea with ice, please. Here you go, sir. Have a nice day. Do I have to put the tip jar out or do I get tips or, or what's going on here? What's going on? Catch up. Here you go, sir. Have a nice day. Two perfect combos. I am unstoppable. Completely unstoppable. There was a nuclear blast outside. Don't worry about it. Our windows are nuclear blast proof. You can enjoy your chicken in peace. Sour cream and onions. I got you covered. That's not quite right. When I said I have you covered, I meant I do not have you covered. There's like a, a pattern to it there. You gotta, you gotta get into the rhythm of it. You can't just toss it immediately. No, I wanna stop. How do I, how do I change the cup size back down? Look, you cake, you're not getting a water. I'm sorry. You know, you don't get a water. I'm, sometimes we just mess up and the machine doesn't let us, you know, redo it. So you just, you get a cola. I know that's not what you wanted, but unfortunately, it's what you get. Sour cream butter and bacon I think I have to like let it cook for a bit first right yeah I gotta let it cook so medium cola with no ice here you go sir have a nice day and you want your oops we got to go in one two three four five six you know go a little bit of that go in here you want you want butter chives that's not chives shoot you wanted to, to do it the other way around there small tea with ice I got you covered have a nice day sir you gotta cook it first. You gotta cook the baked potato before you put the stuff on. It's obvious when you think about it, but when you're in the heat of the moment, you know, it's, it's pretty easy to make up a, a little mistake there like that, you know, so we'll get that cooking. I think the, uh, that the, um, the baked potato might not be a winner for us. Cheese and sour cream, I got you. Don't worry about it. There you go. Why are we tenderizing this on demand? I do not know. I do not know. It uh, it has me equally perturbed. <laughs> no, I I hit the wrong button. Hit the wrong button. It was nothing more than a wrong button hit there. It's nothing more than hitting the wrong button. Okay, I didn't mean to send you the chicken. I accidentally sent you your chicken instead of taking out the trash. It's a very simple mistake to make. We're gonna get your baked potato cooking right away, sir. I recognize you. You're a baked potato man. You need that baked potato. Okay, so we're gonna get this going. We're gonna get a large grape with no ice, please. Here you go, sir. Cheese, sour cream, and butter. Here you go. Have a nice day. Yeah. Just mustard corn dog. I got you. Now we gotta get up to that 12 times perfect combo or we're gonna really have a rough time here. We gotta get that achievement for that. Not sure how much tips we're making today, but we can at least get that perfect combo going on. Cheese and sour cream, I gotcha. Here you go, have a nice day, sir. Everybody is sir, because I'm not actually paying attention to them. I'm sure I've said sir to like a billion men. And onions, there you go. I'm learning, I'm learning. I'm learning the patterns on the baked potato. There you go. 
Got your meat tenderized. I don't know why we're tenderizing your chicken breast on demand. It really kind of confuses me. But you know, sometimes you just gotta do what you gotta do. I think I hit that one seven times. I'm not really sure. I'm not counting. I'm just kind of going by muscle memory. Okay, I'm going by muscle memory. I'm sure I'm not doing it six times every time. Maybe that's why I'm losing my perfect combo. Maybe I should start counting. I think I did okay. We got another perfect combo on that one. That's what matters, is the perfect combos. Your customers are happy, you're happy. Let's get that one going on, like here, and then uh, a medium cola with no ice, please. Here you go, sir. Just butter, please. Here you go, sir. Have a nice day. A large tea with ice. Here you go. Have a nice day. Okay, you want cheese. You want sour cream. You want butter. Have a nice day. Cola with no ice, here you are. Come on, we can we can get these dishes wiped in record time. I can do what I believe in. I will get that cooking. I think I hit that one seven times again. People want their meat tenderized exactly six times, not seven, not five. Cheese, sour cream, and butter. There you go. Gotta flush the toilet. Somebody's, you know. It happens a lot when you're working in fast food. Somebody just doesn't flush the toilet. You gotta go in there. You gotta flush the toilet. You gotta clean it up a little bit. Happens more often than you think it would. Especially if you if you live in a particularly uh, nasty area. We're gonna have to be a little bit faster about this one, okay? Serve that one. Just mustard, please. Here you go. Have a nice day. People are nasty, man. They don't flush the toilets. They don't clean. I mean, I'm not even sure if they're washing after they go up. It's horrible. It's a horrible world to live in. You want butter, chives, and bacon. Have a nice day, sir. A small diet with no ice. Here you are. Look, I've got a lot of experience working in fast food. This is a normal day, okay? Small water with ice. Here you go. Have a nice day. Except the, uh, the, the machines are supposed to be automated. Or you just hand them a cup and they go do it themselves. Not really used to the whole doing it myself thing. I mean, it's kind of a, you know, it's a lot of work, really. It's it's adding a lot of, you know, we all, you know, we also don't generally cook up like we don't tenderize the chicken breast either. That's a that's a very strange one. They also usually have to stop because it takes longer to put mustard onto a bun. But I mean, who's counting really? Me? It's a good point. Here you go, ma'am. Have a nice day. How many tips did we get? How many tips did we get? Tips earned, $12. We're paying that tip jar off in no time. Income of the day, $279. That's good. That's good. We're just going to start a new day. This is a good menu that we've got going on here. We're just going to hop right into it. Mostly because we don't really have time. You want ketchup and mustard? Here you go, sir. Have a nice day. What a beautiful nuclear explosion. Your morning baked potato is in the baker. It'll just be a few minutes here. We just got to get it warmed up. You want everything, hey? Here you go. I don't know why everybody's after the baked potatoes in the wee hours in the morning here, but I don't judge. And I do judge, actually. That is distinctly a lie. I definitely do judge. You guys are weird for getting baked potato in the morning. It's a nuclear explosion outside, and y'all are like, yeah, I want a baked potato, please. Why can't you be like this guy and get a corn dog? I mean, come on, really. Thank you, ma'am. Have a nice day. Dawn of a new era of feasting is upon us. What does that mean? I served you without ice. That's my bad, sir. Please come back and I will give you some ice. I served you raw. Look, sometimes you get into the heat of the moment and you just you mess it up. Now, normally you would notice that before you send it out and then fix it. You don't get that opportunity here because it's uh, it's like a whole thing, right? Nope. Well, you, yep. There you go. Sour cream, chives, and onions. Here you go. Have a nice day. 
Sour cream, bacon, and onions. Okay, have a nice day. Small water with ice. Here you go. You gotta clean these dishes. Get that cooking. The trash is piling up. I know the trash is piling up. Look, we gotta take it out. Normally, you'd have another person here to, to help you out with that. I don't know why it's all on me here, but... Look, it's okay. You're getting a, a large water. I don't know why you'd want a small water. It's kind of weird. What are you doing? I did that completely wrong. It's completely off my rocker on that one. I apologize. Please just flush the toilet when you go to a restaurant. It makes a big difference to the uh, performance of the uh, the restaurant. I think the baked potato might be a little bit too complicated for my, my wee mind to handle. You want cheese, sour cream, butter. I kind of did that in the wrong order, but it's okay. It doesn't really matter. For some reason, cheese is Y and butter is H or something. I don't know. Look, it's all just a, it's all a mess. You just, you got the mess of memory. If somebody puts the, the sauces and the, the condiments in the wrong place on the wall, then you're just, you're messed up for the rest of the day is what it, is what it is. Somebody puts the butter over here when it's supposed to be over there. I mean, your whole day is just from the beginning. Just, it's gone. You may as well just give up now, you know. Here you go, sir. Have a nice day. Oh, we got a little cute rat. We got a little cute rat. Yeah, what are we going to do about that, huh? Take it out like the professionals we are. And we gotta flush the toilet because people are nasty. Just flush the toilet when you when, like when, when you when you go to a restaurant. Just flush the toilet. You know, just just flush it. Don't make a mess. I know it's hard sometimes, but just go home if you're gonna make that much of a mess, man. That's probably why they do it, right? Because it's going to make a mess, so they're like, yeah, I'll just go and make a mess. Somebody else gets to clean up. And then I have to clean it up. Alright, we're going to get you going. You want just butter, please. Here you go. Have a nice day. You want ketchup, mustard. Have a nice day. you got to flush the toilet because people are nasty. All right, we got a medium water with ice. Oh, you got a diet cola with ice. I'm sorry, sir. He was still immediately, moderately happy about it. Medium cola with no ice. Here you go. Have a nice day, man. You want a medium grape with ice, please. Have a nice day. You want cheese, sour cream, butter, and bacon. Have a nice day. You want a small cola with no ice? Here you go. There you go. Very simple order. I can give you your own cup. I don't know why I have to do it for you. Look at all these people waiting on their chicken breast. Nothing else. No buns. No, you know, veggies. No, nothing else. Just, just, a, just a straight chicken breast. It's a little bit strange to me, but I mean, I don't judge. I totally do, actually. We've been over this. I do judge you, but I'm not legally allowed to tell you, or for that matter, I, uh, I just, I shouldn't. It would be bad for business. Cheese and sour cream, here you go. You want butter, chives, and bacon? You got butter, chives, and bacon. Look at that. A master potato maker. Here you go, have a nice day, sir. The mustard and the ketchup's right there. I don't know why they can't do it themselves. What was I just saying, bud? What did I just say? Some people. I can give you a raw potato. You take it home. You stick it in your oven. 425 until it's done. Something like that. I don't know. I don't actually cook baked potatoes. I don't like baked potato. I think it's pretty gross. Potato in general is pretty, pretty not so great. Small grape with ice. Here you go, sir. Have a nice night. I do have some potatoes that I've got to use up, but I mean, I don't, I'm not a big fan of potatoes. Fries are okay, but like, you can't have fries every day. That's just really bad for you. Hash browns are pretty good. Or they can be if you do it right. Anyway, didn't have as good a day. We got more, we got more orders. Perfect. We didn't make as much money. Got the same amount of tips. Got all of our chores completed. 
That's what I'm talking about right there. All right. All right. Okay. You know, I'm going to I'm going to call it. This is an opinion that nobody has ever had before, but Cook Serve Delicious is pretty good. It's pretty good. It's it's pretty good. This game is is pretty good. And I know that's a controversial opinion. I know that I know that most people see Cook Serve Delicious and they're like, "Yeah, well that game <laughs> Could have been something, but I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna say it's pretty good. I'm gonna go against the I'm gonna go against the grain. I'm kidding, of course. This is a a very highly reviewed game, and uh, much praise and like whole trilogy, and it's like an amazing uh, phenomenon of uh, pretending to be a, a worker in a middle you know or a minimum wage job. Um, which is fun for some reason, uh, but this is a really fun game. If you like this kind of game, if it looked like fun, then like get it. It's great. You don't have to get the newest one. The oldest one is also very fun. I don't own the old, the newest one. I will someday. We will definitely play the entire trilogy. I don't know if we'll like do a series on it, but I'll definitely try them out because uh, these games are fantastic. I think Northern Lion voiced the third one, or it might have been a different cooking game. I can't remember. Anyway, um, this game has been really, really great. Again, it is. Two dollars and seventy-four cents on Steam right now, Canadian, because it's seventy-five percent off regular price. Ten ninety-nine Canadian. Um, fantastic deal. Like hundred percent can recommend this game. Really, really fun. Um, I don't know why. I have no idea why, but it's great. So uh, yeah, that's gonna do it for today. Thank you for watching. Remember to like the video if you like it. Subscribe to see more in the future. Code if you have anything to say, and I will see you next time. Bye bye.